Saunders pulling away into the near post. Johnson shot, great block by Gary Pallister. Really good defending by the England man. Pallister became one of the most assured central defenders in English football in his time at United, but he made a far from comfortable start to life at Old Trafford. I remember one game early in Pallister's career at United when uh, we played Liverpool and uh, John Barnes broke the offside trap and, and just left him for dead. And he was the only player that got anywhere near him, but uh, Ronnie Whelan chipped the ball over and John Barnes beat him and ran and he was and he's left in his wake. I don't remember seeing that happen again afterwards though, and that was the measure of Pallister. Well, I just looked at Gary Pallister, he was a real lion heart, uh, a rock at the centre of defence, and he was hard, uh, and he was very difficult to beat. The important saving tackle, Pallister again, he doesn't have to well for For me, he read the game better than the strikers. He knew what the striker was going to do before Lane knew what he was going to do. He saw a pass coming from the midfielder and made his way in, and he just seemed to, without desperately sliding in or having to use his body with it. He just seemed to step in and just nick the ball away. He just made it look so easy. They couldn't beat him for pace. They couldn't beat him in the air. He became dangerous in terms of becoming an attacking threat. He was capable of making those long runs forward. And Pallister had a tremendous amount of footballing ability. What a run from Gary Pallister! His partnership with Steve Bruce was one of the most successful centre-back pairings in United's history. Two very different types of defender, they complemented each other perfectly. Whatever Bruce missed, you knew he was going to get. Whatever he missed, you knew Bruce was in there, and him and Bruce together. I don't think, even for me in those days, they could have been topped. Whereas you got the steel of Bruce, you got the silk of Pallister. And those two, they were the hub, they were the rock upon which the rest of the team were built. Chance for City here, and still Manchester United's goal stays intact at Old Trafford. Only because of Gary Pallister, Martin. This is what you call defending from the big man. I remember him scoring a fantastic free kick. We'd already won the title, but he scored a fantastic free kick against Blackburn. Uh, it was a great finish, and it just proved that he actually he did have a couple of feet as well. It wasn't just his head, and it wasn't just the fact that he was strong either. But in my eyes, Pallister was one of the great centre-backs at United. 